Whole Alive's Usada Pecora has recently been the big talk of Whole Alive due to her countless streams of fake Grand Order, playing the story ever since she was given permissions as well as rolling for a single character to over 100,000 consecutive viewers until she finally got her. Now, Pecora has probably spent a ton of money on the game already, but those aren't the purchases that have had many fans surprised and worried for months. But before I tell you about that, let's look at our sponsor, Idol Corp, who just showcased their newest and first group of English towns that all look wonderful, debuting on the 20th of November. Some of them have already started posting short on YouTube, so go subscribe to their channels, link in the description. Now, Pecora recently made a brand new Twitter account just for her to ship post or tweet on a regular basis called Uraka Peko, where she's been posting cats and things about fake Grand Order. However, out of nowhere, Pecora hit us with an image of her family member, Jill. Now, Jill was introduced to us months ago. However, many just could not believe Pecora actually purchased this animal, referring to it as a monkey, thinking it was fake, or Pecora somehow would let it pass away. But as of yesterday, we now have confirmation that Jill is real and alive. People saying things like, quote, can't believe the monkey possesses the drip, and Pecora has a monkey with a Christmas collar. This is the best post ever. Others saying, what the fuck, I thought this was just a meme. Nope, this is not a meme. Pecora actually owns a fucking monkey. Well, not a monkey, since Pecora has addressed over sees bros calling Jill a monkey and all of the quote he's alive remarks saying this Now, with all of that said, calling Jill a monkey may not be all that incorrect, since according to my simple Google search and no other research other than that, they are referred to as, quote, night monkeys, and that's all I need to continue calling Jill a monkey. Anyway, Jill is super cute, and I hope to see Pecora posting more pictures of them in the future. But let me know what you all think about this conclusion to the Pecora monkey art. As we move over to Niji Sanji's Millie Parfait, telling Clippers to tag her in their clips so she can watch them and comment on them. So if you're a Millie or a Nina Clipper that wants to be noticed, make sure to at them. But in some sad news regarding Niji Sanji, we've had Pomu Rainpuff tweeting out, quote, my mama's main account got hacked, even with two verification security on. A lot of accounts have been compromised lately, so be sure to update your passwords. Stay safe, everyone. So this really does suck that so many people on Twitter have recently been losing their accounts, even with two-factor on. The best way to prevent this is to not click on any suspicious links and to change your passwords often, I guess. Hopefully, they're able to get their account back, though. But it's now time for some rapid rabbit news, like Jaden Animations announcing a subathon on YouTube and at the end of the video, teasing what looks like a VTuber model. Iris releasing her music video on the 13th and Sarah's Fauna returning to streaming today, stating that she will not be reading any super chats talking about Clover as to keep the mood of the streams from going down. Now, I am really happy to see Sarah's Fauna back, but I do hope she's doing well and taking care of herself. Same thing I hope for all of you. Please have a wonderful rest of your day. Bye-bye.